You're tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. I am back. Rudrance for Black and White Sports 2. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe, like, comment, share. Let me know what you think about this in the comment section. So we've got all world superstar wide receiver Tyree Kill, who may be in a bind. The police are involved right now investigating an incident involving a guy down in a marina. Assault battery is being brought up. Ironically, it is on. It happened after after or during the fishing trip that Drew Rosenhaus went on. He went with Drew, his agent. And I don't I don't know if Drew was there when the incident actually happened, if it was before or after. We don't know any of that as of right now. And I do have a kind of interesting side note on this involving Drew Rosenhaus. In fact, let's just look at it. This is Drew Rosenhaus right here. Uh, he was wrestling with sharks. And we believe this is, uh, may have been, they said, incident. Now, they're saying this is on Tuesday. And I believe this incident was on Monday. But Drew Rosenhaus was, I guess, around Tyree Kill or on this fishing trip or something. But there's Drew, Drew Ro, that's TMZ, that's Drew Rosenhaus actually holding the, the tail end of a shark. All right. These guys got different things to do than I do. Uh, Fox News, just about a month before training camp, Tyreek Hill has found himself in hot water. Miami-Dade police told Fox News Digital on Tuesday that they are, quote, investigating an allegation of assault and battery involving the Miami Dolphins wide receiver. Miami Local 10 News reports that Hill allegedly hit a man on Sunday working at Hall Over Marina after the two got into a disagreement. Miami-Dade police were seen at the marina on Monday, and police confirmed the investigation underway on Tuesday. Okay, here we go. Hill was fishing with his agent, Drew Rosenhaus, on Tuesday. So, evidently, or, or maybe, maybe not, maybe he was not with Rosenhaus on Sunday and Monday. Maybe they were just together on Tuesday. That's kind of interesting. Doesn't sound like Drew Rosenhaus or Tyreek Hill were sweating the situation too much. The receiver is entering his second season with the Dolphins after spending his first six seasons with the Chiefs, winning a Super Bowl with them. He has been a pro bowler in each of his first seven seasons. In this past season, he was named first team all pro for the fourth time. I mean, he's really damn good, folks. Uh, he's, he's arguably the best weapon in the league or one of the top maybe five weapons in the league, I think. The 29-year-old racked up career highs with 119 catches and 1,710 receiving yards. Miami's mini camp from June 6th through the 8th. Their report date for training camp has not been announced as of yet. Wow. Wow. So um, Tyreek Hill is in a real situation here. Now, again, it's kind of odd. This happened on Sunday. He's out fishing, hanging out with his agent on Tuesday. I don't know if this trip with Drew Rosenhaus was all-inclusive, and Drew Rosenhaus is really a side piece to this. Anyway, I saw him wrestling with sharks and was like, F it, I'll show that too uh, in the video. So this is going to bear watching because obviously if it takes a step legally, then, well, Tyreek Hill, then the NFL will get involved and they will start investigating and who knows whether or not they would get into the personal conduct policy or how that will be handled at that point, right? Or nothing may come out of it whatsoever. At this point, we just don't know. But I'm sure the Miami Dolphins surely don't want to lose him for any time this season. Tell me what you think, Black and White Sports 2 supporters. Peace, I'm out. Till next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.